Hello friends, welcome to Unity 3D teacher tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to convert the slide for a progression bar and for whatever the timer, whatever you like to go, uh, you want to use a slider for that. So in that case, you want to show without any issue. Unity, by default, Unity slider, slider have some issues. So we are going to see what is the issue while we creating a slider for a to your progression bar and we are going to solve that so it's generally like root cause in finding a root cause and solving the issue okay so let's go to the video so i'm going to create a slider okay so we have the slider here slider is generally we are, uh, while increasing your volume or music whatever we can use like this so generally for progression bar this knob won't come right so without the knob the progression will go automatically it won't be controlled by user so in order to do that we are going to remove this knob okay so without the knob user can't able to control this correct so even we can do recasting also so generally you can remove your requesting so that is the idea but uh, the next thing is uh, we want to show the color okay so color while progressing so i'm going to have some background color like this and fill color like this green okay usually it will be green so i'm going with green so everything is set up now so manually we tweak the value fill value okay so go to the slider and let's have 1 to 10 we have 1 1 to 10 so it's going to be a whole number so if you see at the 10th value there will be a if you zoom and scale you can able to see there will be some space right so while in progression we want to solve the issue i'm right so we can't able to show to the user like this so in order to avoid that so after we remove that knob this kind of issue will occur so in order to avoid that i'm going to going for fill area choose a rectangle tool and increase the size till this rectangle finish okay sorry let's zoom it zoom it out so click on the rectangle area and finish at end similarly like click on the rectangle area and make it as set as at the beginning okay so everything is fine now now if you see the output it will be imperfect okay let's see yeah it's filling perfectly but if you see my value is 1 here but the maximum value is 10 so for maximum value filling is perfect but if you see the minimum value of 1 it's not filling it's not reducing and make making showing as default 0 so in order to avoid that we are going to do one more settings go to the fill area the fill okay inside that there will be a fill so here if you see the width we want to make as zero okay that's it so let's try now yeah so it's working perfect so that's it guys so in this way you can be able to convert your slide slider to a progression bar so you don't want to manually create a sprite or something you can easily use a slider and change the input graphics in background and then whatever you can able to change with the background and then fill color that's it thank you and thanks for watching